all right everyone welcome back thank you so much for stopping by i appreciate it so in today's video i want to explain to you how a four-way switch works with a line diagram um, so bear with me this gets pretty confusing um, but let me just go ahead and start by drawing the power source the panel right here and then your light over here which will represent the switch leg and then i'm just going to draw the switches here so you got your three-way switch right here um, and I can, I'm going to draw this the easy way so it doesn't get confusing. So you have your common right there, your traveler right there, and then um, another traveler. So the travelers are going to be in uh, blue and red, and the, the commons are going to be in black. And then I'm going to put the green for the switch positions so you can see that more easily. So you're going to have this, and then you're going to have your four-way switch like this with your other two travelers and then the um, other um, three-way switch over here these colors are kind of getting backwards but I think that's how I saw it online had to look this up because I understand how all this works but there's uh, the four-way switches are a little bit different for um, the line diagram so anyways here is your travelers you have a traveler between the three-way switch and the four-way switch um, and the same thing on the other side four-way switch to three-way switch and then you have another traveler here another traveler here um, so here's your travelers between the switches and then your power source over here going to this common and then your switch leg going up to your light right here so I'm going to draw the switch position. Oh yeah, and these are internally connected diagonally. So I don't really know how to draw the switch position on these. So I'm just gonna write um, like blue on this and then I'll switch it to red so you know which uh, line that it's going through. So say the flipper on this one is that way and this one is this way. So if it is going through the blue switch, so this, I don't know, doesn't really have an on or off but um, on the three-way switch this one is this position this one is this position and then the four-way switch is on the blue um, the blue set of travelers so if you follow the power goes through this switch goes through the blue it's not going to work and turn the light on because it's not connecting the power right here up to the light so if you switch this to the red and then that changes this here to red so then your power comes here goes through the red and turns the light on um, and if you disconnect it over here and go to blue it's not going to work because the power is still on the red traveler and if you remember from last time only one traveler uh, works at a time only one traveler has power at the same at once um, so if you go through the blue one it's not going to work because it's not connected right here sending the power through it's on the red um, so once again if you change this works there's so many different variables here um, you can flip this one up flip that one down flip the middle one down flip this one all that stuff so I showed you guys in the last video how that works um, how to troubleshoot that in the real world but there's just so many different ways that you can do this on the line diagram but I hopefully you get the point already, even though this video is already short. So once again, I will go through this one more time. Um, if you want to go through the red, and then, I don't know, maybe I was just on the red, but red, the light doesn't turn on. If you go to blue, then it's going to work. If you go over here to red, then it's not going to work because the power's on the blue and if you go um, blue on here uh, see now i just mixed now i just confused myself this one has to something has to change on here so once again basically you're just cutting the three-way switch in half and putting basically a switch in the middle to change the direction of the travelers so hopefully that makes a little bit more sense but um anyways in the real world it's a lot easier and but trying to understand it 
line diagramically, it is a little more confusing. Um, so hopefully that helps you out. I, like I said, I don't know how to draw that switch of position on the middle, but if you follow the power lines, then um, that does make sense. If you switch one of these sides, then whatnot. That's not going to work. If you switch this back to this, then it's going to work. So just follow the lines. If there's power flowing through it completely through all the screws on that traveler, it's going to work. If not, then it's not going to work. This one doesn't have power. If you go here, then it's going to work again. So, yeah. So hopefully that makes a little bit of sense. Um, I'm probably not doing the best job at all, but thank you for watching. I appreciate it. Um, as always, if you enjoyed, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe. I would appreciate it. It would help the channel grow. Love to see you guys back in the next video. Giveaway ends today um, at, what was it, 5 p.m.? So make sure to check that video and be entered. Um, you have a few hours left by the time this video releases on, um, I guess, premiere time or whatever you call it. Um, so this video is scheduled to release at 1 p.m. on Sunday. So um, you have a few more hours, four more hours to get entered. Well, four hours and 59 minutes to be entered because it closes at 5 p.m., um, I believe if that was the correct time that it ended at. So check the video for correct time that that ends. But anyways, hit the notification bell to be notified when I upload or do live streams. And that should do it, guys. Everyone have an awesome rest of your night. God bless. See you in the next one. Peace out.